Hello everyone. Today I wanted to share with you my journey with crystals and how I got involved with them and how I got into working with them and how they helped me. So about three years ago I was working abroad teaching and I had an accident and I had a very bad back injury and so that made me kind of um, lay in bed for months. For about two months, I couldn't walk and I couldn't sit. I couldn't stand. So I, I couldn't work. And that actually caused me a lot of anxiety. And since I was away from home, it even caused me more anxiety. And I, I was living with my boyfriend at the time. Uh, well, the boyfriend I'm still with, but... Um, in the relationship, I didn't want to leave and come back home and leave him there. I was having um, just low self-esteem issues. It, it really affected me, the injury and the fact that I had to stop everything. I was kind of stuck with my mind and I had to work with my own inner issues at the same time as dealing with the injury and not being able to work and... So what happened was um, I, I have a very good friend who I met through my work there and she told me a story about her best friend and she always said that she reminded me, of, she re, that her friend reminded her of me because we had a lot in common. Um, we were both artists and sensitive people and kind of even looked similar and she was always sharing her friend's stories with me and one thing she kept telling me is that um, her friend actually had the same uh, life story as me. She was living with her boyfriend in Hawaii, so abroad from home, and she had her back injury. And so she told me her story, and she said that she had she decided to come back home, but she was in a horrible shape. She came back in a wheelchair back to her home, and um, then went through months of chiropractor, psychiatry, a lot of things to work out her issues. And, sorry, this is my parrot Tiki, by the way. He's biting my hand while I'm talking to you guys. He wants to, he wants to introduce himself. This is Tiki. Tiki. Yes, you haven't been introduced yet. You haven't been introduced yet in my last previous videos. He wants attention. So we'll keep him here in the video. So, anyway, um... To make a long story short, my friend told me to come back home. She said you should just go back home and this is ruining your relationship, it's ruining your life and go home and get better. I'm always done. And, um, and then one thing she told me also is that she worked with Crystal. Her friend worked with Crystal and that's how... That's what I, sorry about that, I had to restart. Someone was being a bit energetic. Okay, so back to my story. When my friend told me to told me her friend's story and uh, told me how she worked with crystals, I started thinking about crystals. I was curious. I did lots of research online. I got some books on crystals. At first, it was a bit weird uh, to think of the idea for me because I never thought that crystals could be therapeutic. Um, however, when I came back home to my parents' place, what I discovered was a, a part of me from my past, from years ago, that I completely had forgotten about, and that was that I used to love crystals, and I've always loved crystals, and I've always... Oh, worked with them when I was a kid. I always collected them. I went to crystal shops in high school. And so it was actually a part of my life, a, a distant part of my life that I had forgotten about. So I kind of rediscovered it. And I started researching crystal therapy. I read lots of books and I got more and more involved. And then I realized how beneficial it was for me and how um, 
how they actually, the, the, the vibration of crystals, their energy really affects me on a deep level. And that's a whole other topic that I can talk about later, but um, through working with crystals and through discovering them again, I also discovered other things that kind of um, unfolded this whole path of healing for me that, that I never would have gotten into otherwise. For example, I learned about I learned more about aromatherapy. I started as I was reading crystal books. I read about chakras and their connection to to aromatherapy, essential oils. And then I got interested in that. I got involved with that, and I also got involved with astrology through aromatherapy. Actually, because I saw I I read about the connection, the correspondences of herbs and, and essential oils to planets and that was just a whole new world opened up for me and I'm so passionate about all those things and I think the artistic side of me that wasn't able to create since I had the back injury and actually the back injury kind of affected other parts of my body. So it wasn't just my back, it was my knee and my arms. And I started just, just you know, just I had a lot of anxiety. And it took a long time to get over all that. So this, this is a, this is, I have, I have a lot to say about that. But what I, I really thank crystals for unfolding into my life. And I think this is going to be a passion I'm going to have for the rest of my life. Um, I cherish them dearly, and uh, can't say more good things about them. So, I would love to share that uh, share that experience with you in my next videos, and hopefully, Cheeky here won't be distracting me too much, right? Okay. See you later. Take care. Thank you for watching.